The components required for this experiment are node MC board, PIR motion sensor, breadboard, LED, buzzer, connecting wires and connecting cable. Now go to the Arduino IoT Cloud website, click sign in, here enter the username and password and then click sign in. Now from the left side menu, click things, here we need to create a new thing, for that click this plus thing button. Now rename this thing, click here and click rename, I am giving the thing name as motion alert notification. and click rename button. Now we need to add a variable, click this add button and give the variable name as motion detected and select the variable type as boolean because the trigger will accept only the boolean or string variables. So here we no need to do any changes and click add variable button. Here we now we need to associate the device. So click select device and then click set up new device and then select third party device. So here we are using ESP8266 board. So the board is selected. Now we need to select the model. So the model name number is Node MC 1.0. Now click continue and then here we can give the device name. Tech Trends Motion Alert. Now click next. Copy the secret key. Select this checkbox and click continue and then click done. Now we need to configure the network. So click this configure button, enter the Wi-Fi username and Wi-Fi password and paste the secret key which we copied and click save. Now we need to create the trigger. For that go to this menu and select triggers menu. Now click this trigger button and create a new trigger. We need to rename this trigger. Click rename trigger and the name I am giving is motion alert. Click rename button. Now we need to link the variable. Click this cloud variable and this is our thing motion alert notification. Click this variable and click link variable button. Now this condition is satisfied. It will send the actions, send email and send push notifications. First we can click send email. Here we can give the subject and the description. So I am giving the subject as motion detected. We can give the same in the email body and then click send push notification. Here also we can give the same or we can give any other text. Now click done. Initially the trigger will be in the off state. We need to turn on this trigger to get the notification. Click this button and turn on the trigger. Now again go back to things menu. Here select the thing motion at notification. Now go to sketch. Here the basic template is generated. Now we need to add the logic. So I am pasting the program which I wrote before. Copy this and paste here. And now I will explain the program. So the sensor pin is connected to GPIO2 which is pin number D4 and LED is connected to GPIO5 which is D1 and the buzzer is connected to GPIO4 which is D2. So now 
we are assigning the pin uh, sensor pin as input and the buzzer and led as output now this is the condition so if any motion is detected so it will call this function send motion status and it will call the activate led and activate buzzer function so if any motion is de detected the led will turn on and the buzzer will also turn on so if there is no uh, motion so the led will off and there will be no buzzer sound now we need to upload the program for that connect your board to the laptop and click this arrow button now the program is successfully uploaded to the node mcu board now we can check the output we can also check the alert in the email 